I'm in the crib though, smoking on Endo. That's free yeah. Rizzo. I can't be outside. My Nizzo need a little break. This nigga sipping on the Capri Sun, man. Yeah. I'm saying that I'll probably back off. This nigga said he's vegan, but, but he's sipping it, it, on Capri Sun. I'm gonna be Suns. inside, but you know it's this shit crazy. Capri Sun, like nigga, <laughs> <laughs> it's hating on my thumb. Hey, what's good though? That's not a Capri Sun. That's not a Capri Sun. You said tripping. So, so see, mm-hmm. you said tripping. <laughs> Episode five. Episode five. Five. Good fever. Cussed already. Them kids got the fever. <laughs> it's impossible, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's impossible. It's impossible. Them Episode boys five. I want to see you shine. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Episode five. Good fella podcast. Your fevers. You know what I'm saying? Are we on the air. Yes, sir. <laughs> we on the air. Back with another. What? Sh- last time we recorded again. was in the room. Yep, at the, no at the telly. Yeah, Pause. bro. <laughs> yeah, that did sound kind of crazy. No homo. It no definitely homo. looked like a back, uh, goddamn, um, never mind. Mm-hmm. I'm just going to leave that one alone. <laughs> 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 I'm mighty fast highlights. Mm-hmm, I'm fucking with it. Good highlights. Good highlights. Good highlights. A lot of stuff been going on. Ha- yeah. Ca- kind of. I mean, in the world, yes. In the world, yes. Kendrick dropped. Everybody's waiting on it. How y'all feel about that? I still ain't listen to it all the way. I through. still ain't listen to it. I ain't listen to it. I I listen to that. I don't listen to that Kodak song. No, dude. Dang, girl, why is that though? Because I my go bad. Ahead, go ahead. I I hadn't listened to Pussy shit yet. Like, dang, you you started. You already started that, so you can't stop listening to Pussy shit. Like now, I'm like just trying to digest that before I move to something else. Yeah, because those is okay. You know what I'm saying? The, 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 that yeah, that like them they drop music. You got to digest. You just can't listen to it. And then yeah, you got to listen to it. Four five times, really. You been listening to that work down there. Yeah, ain't no um, <laughs> <laughs> ain't no microwave music coming from them boys. Yeah, no, nah, you really gotta you gotta sit on it for a second. So that's what I've been on. I just, I just figured that Kendrick Lamar was gonna be like the Jay Z four for four album. That's what I looked at it last. So that's why I ain't really listened to it yet. Cause I'm like, from the little two songs I had heard already before it even dropped, I'm like, yeah, he sound like he on his grown man. So yeah. I'm gonna check it out. I just. I just ain't really sat down and listened to it yet. There's so much music I ain't listened to yet. I still need to listen to that Nas album. The, uh, he dropped that a couple months ago. What was that King Disease 2, I think it yeah, was? Yeah, I ain't, I ain't even I listened to listen that yet. I heard that was a good album. Man. Yeah, I ain't even listened to that all the way through. There's so much music I need to listen to. Uh, well, how you feel about it, Magic? I mean, we played it, it about 20, 30 times that way. We didn't listen to it too we, many times. We listened to it four hours straight. Yeah. On repeat. I can respect that. That's a good album right there. If you don't like it, you don't like music. Mm. If you like Future album and you don't like Kendrick album, you trash. I f- I feel like it's a good um, it's a more personal album for Kendrick. You get to know more about his life than just him rapping about bars and stuff going on. He actually like LA. personalizing his music. Yeah, it's more yeah. of him venting. Okay. And um, yeah, it just sounds like he in a better Different place zone. now. He don't he don't want to be that guy. And rap that's uh, the savior of hip hop anymore. He just wanna live his life. Be him. Be him. So that's what I got from him. So I can respect that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, like I can that. respect that too. I, yeah, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna dive into. It. I'm just still on push this stuff, man. So but I'm gonna definitely dive. I rock with Kendrick. I'm just over there. The fact that Pusher got Malice on the album was fire. That song is hard, too. He got Malice on there? Yes. Oh, wow. That song is hard. It's the last song on there, too. So it catch you off guard. And it really sounds so good together. At first, you got to be like, hold on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right. Like, is, is that him or is that, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and, wow. I didn't know that. No, I didn't. And you, you said the beats was nice on there, too, though. The beats is different. Well, at first, so at first, I was listening like how iTunes got it set up, like when it pop up, it it pop up like the the Yay versus Pharrell first, like before like the original album in its original form. Mm-hmm. So when they playing like that, you like it throw the vibe off because they got Pharrell stuff first, and they're just all like knockers, bro. You know how Pharrell beats yeah. is. Then Kanye like the more soulful stuff. See, so be like, damn, yeah. like this don't sound good. But like in 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 order, like in the order of the track song, like when it mixed in together, bro, it, it bro, it's, it's, it's a masterpiece. Nice. It's a masterpiece. Like, at first, I'm like, I don't really know if I like these J tracks. Then I'm like, I listen to it in the order. I'm like, iTunes got me on dirt for real. Yeah. Talking about Ye vs. for real. <laughs> then they, no, I ain't going to say they got me on. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, dang. Like, so I, I know what they're trying to do. So it's not like 
five for real tracks then kanye is, is actually mixed together yeah yeah okay, yeah okay Big, I, but, I thought it was yeah. ready because it said for real versus kanye Exa- so, exactly so that's how i seen it because i got one half and kanye got the bottom half that's how they did it or itunes but that's not how that's the original, not how the original checklist, checklist is checklist. Why they do it like that? i don't know that's what i'm saying so when i click, crazy man so when i clicked on the actual like you know what i'm saying and it was in the order of the actual i'm like it oh like yeah like it makes sense why like it go together it piece together way better wow yeah, next album we play for the rest of the year no, when y'all get when y'all get that's bro. Yo. Yeah, I haven't listened to that album. Yeah, no. I'm still trying to digest Kendrick album. No, y'all you know get that started. Y'all gonna be like, oh yeah. Oh yeah, I'm gonna check that out for real. Yeah, we had mixed. Uh, what is it? It's uh, a pimp a butterfly. butterfly and uh, this album together. Mr. R- Morel, the yeah, they, big uh, steps. You gotta do that. It's Make a nice a little combination. Together, throw that mug on shuffle. But a lot of people mad about Kodak being on there. Really, I don't know how you can be mad at that though. I don't know, man. Like, a lot of people don't like Kodak. What, what, what happened with Kodak in the past with about that that case he had? That girls, people bringing that up, and Kendrick got a whole song on there about, um, uh, what is it? Family. Uh, I can't say the word on here. The R word and being abused. Oh, okay. So he got a, a whole song on there talking about that Kendrick opening up about that going on in his family. Then you got somebody who. Allegedly, did, did it. Allegedly, got a case. Yeah, for so world. people confused about that. But um, yeah, a lot of people just don't like. Pop- but I'm even trying to. Never mind. That's a different discussion. No, I'm gonna go there. <laughs> so even with that, like, how many famous people, athletes, rappers, actors have been Rock accused of that? Yeah. And it or and it not been and it not been true or be true. So I'm because I'm I mean none of us are in the room, so we only can say what we hear, what we hear or. So it's like, I don't know. And I ain't saying that it it did or didn't happen. But it's just like, unless you got it like. It sounds a little fishy. You know what I'm saying? Like unless but it's on video or. It's yeah. Like but even, even then, though, you still can't even be mad at Kendrick for putting Kodak no, on the album. for sure. Because out of the younger generation, Kodak, the only one I know that actually was talking about some real life shit mm-hmm. whether it be p- politics or whatever right. and he made sense talking about it yeah. a lot of people don't want to realize that because that, that tunnel vision that shit was hard back yeah. in the day I mean uh, what was that other song he came out with he had a little dance too right before he got locked up it had the burning crosses and shit in the background I that, was tunnel that was tunnel vision okay yeah, yeah. I couldn't remember yeah. but yeah he was talking that, he was talking that political shit in there mm-hmm. next thing you know he going to prison for four or five years you know what I'm saying yeah. so I don't know I ain't got no problem with Kodak being on Kendrick album. People don't. It's better than Meg Thee Stallion. I'll tell you that. <laughs> no, nah, no, for real. People don't think that, like. They think he done. Yeah, they see Kodak image. They don't think that he, like, they think he want to like them, what they call mumble rap, something like that. Man, Kodak is talking. Kodak Project Baby, man. Yeah, Kodak is talking, he's talking smart, some real though. stuff, man, He's bro. smart. That's why I'm glad Kendrick put him on there so he could shake <clears> the light. Like, he really got something to say. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Don't look at his image, the way how he speak, actually listen to his words read his lyrics he really saying he really got a message in the song oh that's you know? a fact he tell you the good and bad and you know so shout cause out I'm a K-Dot. project baby Kendrick album solid you know yeah I'm a, I, I gotta dive in yeah yeah, yeah. so they kinda I, I don't like reading I don't like reading about like albums before you go into it because it gives like a you already kind of make it put your mind in a certain spot before you listen to it. Mm-hmm. So it's like, I'm seeing a lot of negative about his album, but I don't, I, I mean, I'm not taking it that, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people think it's boring. People want to do good kid, Mad City, Kendrick for his last album on TDE. Right. And I and I heard a lot of people talking about like his, <laughs> I hate Twitter, but <laughs> they go they going on Kendrick like his beat selection. They like his beat selection is worse than Nas. Like, bro, nah, his his. <laughs> Nobody beat selection is worse than Nas. I'm like, dang, bro, like hey, that's man, crazy. What I'm, what I'm not gonna let y'all do is slander my nigga Nas. No, I'm bro. Nas is my favorite. Nas is my Nas is my favorite rapper, so I'm not slander Nas. Slander Nas all day. Your beat selection is trash. You crazy man? I like Nas. Nas beat selection go with his flow. He just ain't a club nigga. He ain't making Nas beat selection go with his flow. Outside of Uchi Wally. Which is Wiley, the only one club mic. song he really made like that. His best beat is one mic, ain't it? <laughs> man, y'all sick, man. 
That mug was simple. Y'all sick, man. I can't believe this is going on, man. It's <laughs> so disrespectful, man. Crazy. Good fellas, <laughs> crazy. Nas beats are trash. Hey, I'm, y'all out of y'all mind, I'm, man. I fuck with Nas beats. Nas, man, Nas got one of the most hardest diss tracks ever in life, man. And that beat is hard as hell. Right. But that don't mean that, his beats is good. Future got the coldest beats and probably the worst what? That made you look beat as hard. Life's a bitch. New York state of mind. Let's keep going. You feel me? All them beats is hard. Yeah, man. Y'all out your mind, man. He's just no, not a Jay Z rapper, it's man. Just an opinion. You say he not a Jay Z. Oh Z-Z. my God. Oh, no disrespect to the people listening, man. I'm just seeing the nasty anchor roll. Yeah, he ain't coming home oh tonight. Oh my gosh, bro. He done. Yeah, he ain't coming home. And she home immediately tonight. got untied off of anchor roll, bro. That's how you know you're fried. Marcus Smart just got hurt, ladies and gentlemen. It's a wrap. It's yeah, a wrap man. Sorry, we got the TV in the background playing and so shit. You heard it oh. first now. On a good fellas podcast. Well, shit, this is a nice segue, then, man. How y'all feel about the NBA playoffs so far? Because last time we was doing, I think we had just started the NBA playoffs. Just started last time we did the pod. Man, I'm I'm sick, man. <clears throat> uh, I'm not gonna say I'm sick. I like it, but it's about to be the Warriors versus. <laughs> I don't know who coming out the East still. Even though the Celtics are getting murdered tonight. The Celtics not making it. Then Marcus just got hurt. Marcus just got hurt. It might be a wrap now, man. He the heart. Might be Miami and motherfucking the Warriors for the final boy. And then the Warriors gonna scud them, bro. Oh, yeah. f- of course. <laughs> I get them about it there. They're gonna label Steph Curry as the GOAT, you know what I'm saying? Because he did it without KD. You feel me? They already were saying that, though. That's crazy. They saying um, Steph Curry is the, is the best. Uh, you gotta think, though. You KD is one of the best players in the NBA. He leaves the NBA team no matter what it is. And, and it's they still fucking good, though. They have one bad year. Well, they didn't even need him in the yeah. first place. No, no he went there for no reason. I mean, I, I mean, he went there for a reason to get his rings, but I mean, he wouldn't. Outside yeah. of that, he took Harrison Byron's spot. Like Harrison yes, Byron yeah, skunked sure. that playoff before they got rid of Harrison Byron's, mm-hmm. brought KD over. They knew they could at least get 15, 20 out of KD. Right. You know what I'm saying? Harrison Byron's, he going to choke. He going to do whatever the fuck he going to do. Yeah. He just didn't get it done. But, yeah, I mean, Warriors, they look like the team that's going to be it, be it, man. But it might be some weird shit in the NBA this year. They might just say, fuck the Warriors. I'm like, yeah, we're going to give it to Miami. And even like how, and really just being honest, like the Warriors just took care of business at home. And I ain't saying that like Luka had 40, almost 40 last game, but then nobody else on his team really scored for it. Mm-hmm. So it's like with them going back home, and yeah. probably some of the role players, if it can go back, I'm, you feel me? It's still early. Like they took business at home. So the Mavs go home, take care of business, and go back to Warriors. You know what I'm saying? Go back to Golden State, too, too. You never know. Yeah. No, I'm just going, like I said, man, I don't know. If I'm what's the name, I'm gonna let that, I'm gonna let Luke get Luca get 45, but everybody else ain't scoring shit. He gonna have to be the one to beat everybody. He gonna have to beat the whole squad, bro. The I was watching, bro. I watching Luca play, bro. It's like, bro. I'm at the bar last night. I'm just sitting there like, bro. This dude is different, bro. Like he was literally doing what he wanted to do. Yeah. On first, bro. That's first what I mean. They got um. Andrew Wiggins on them. They trying to offset him with his athleticism. Killing Andrew Wiggins. He ain't heavy enough. So they put Draymond on him. Draymond way too slow, which is crazy. <laughs> so I'm like, oh, my God. Like, he just really doing what he want to do. Like, that is crazy. Draymond too slow. Dude. It's real life easy basketball. You know what I'm saying? But like I was. That's what I mean. Like, I'm going to let him score 40, <laughs> but everybody else ain't getting 10 buckets. I ain't letting nobody else score. You're going to have to beat us by yourself, Luca. It was like, bro, I'm watching this. At the, I'm like, bro, Luca really is. But that's like we was talking about, like when yeah. you're professional at 13, 14, it's, it make, it's just a whole that's different weird. world. They, they they play they against everybody. And over there, I can hand check you when you're dribbling. I can, you know what I'm saying? Even if your ball on the rim, I can smack it off the rim. Like, it's just like. And you know they got him playing point, too. So, right. at the same time, he playing these uh, guards that's going to be smaller than him all day and all night. And exactly. Can touch him so he can just yeah, and go crazy. Yeah. Right, because my, 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 when I square up, you can't touch me overseas. I can literally put my hand and try to direct where you're going. Play nigga you feel me? <laughs> yeah, so for I, real. I didn't catch that Phoenix game. So what what happened with them? <laughs> I heard they CP uh, CP CP three must have ran out of the the uh, the, the Space Jam Magic Gym. Juice, man. Cause they said he they said De- so uh, they said that DeAndre Ayton ain't about to be a uh, a, son a son next year. I am surprised by that. So I guess something happened. Like he young minded, he does some goofy shit. Probably pissed him yeah. off. Yeah. So it was like it's something that happened. And then they said Chris Paul faked the injury. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's a whole bunch. No, oh, for real. Whole yeah, whole like it's a. Because Pat Beverly had called it out. He like, <laughs> he like, he like, if the, he like if the Suns lose, 
expect Chris Chris Paul to come up with an injury. Oh wow! He this is like it. early in the day. This is like why they still saying? playing. You feel me? Like shit. early. So then at the end of the game, somebody had reported one of them insiders, NBA insider guys on Twitter, Quiet tweeted energy. that and said said uh, they seen CP leaving the game or leaving the arena with a with a slight limp. They asked him about it, but he wasn't comment. Mm. I'm just like, man, it's funny as hell, man. Yeah. So they're talking about his yes, quads. He's, quad, so he's gonna the bed, man. He's gonna the bed, bro. <coughs> he's gonna be one of them great ass point guards or great ass players that just never won. Damn. Did Chris Paul get to the finals? Oh, last, last year. Yeah, year. last year. Last year was it. He ain't get it's a wrap round. They, they, they blow a two point lead and then he done blew what six, seven uh two two leads. leads, some crazy shit like that. Like, yeah, bro. I don't think Chris Paul can do it, bro. Ever. Yeah. Either that or he just run out of mojo to the end, man, when the shit really come, for real. I think what Chris Paul is, I'm hate to say this. So, Chris, I think Chris Paul got, got the gas to get you there, but when it's, when it's time to get you there, like. He ain't got it. He don't got it no he more. He ain't got it. Like, he could lead you there when it's time for him to put on, when it's time to get there. Yeah, they, nef- they definitely need a third score, though. For sure. They, they definitely got to do something, because when Devin Booker ain't got it going, they got to have somebody else get the buckets. And even with that, I'm like, um. I feel like they got it, but they got it, but Chris Paul just so ball dominant. Like, yeah. bro, like you probe, he dribbled for so long, bro. Like, he dribbled so much, I think it knocked everybody out of rhythm. That, that would do it. Like, yeah. if, if yeah. you got a player that dribbled too much, it take everybody else out of rhythm. So, Chris Paul would dribble, come off that high ball screen, dribble to the other side, twin leg, twin leg, twin leg, come back for another ball screen and pass it. Like, bro, look, you just dribble for 15 seconds and give it to me. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, no, period. You got stiff. Period. That nigga ain't gonna hurt like a bitch, man. I don't know why he, he just came back on the floor to get him some life. Yeah, man. He ain't getting back in that yeah, game. Yeah, bro. That's gonna swell up tonight. Shit, that bitch on his way already, if it ain't already. They about to shoot that adrenaline in that boy for real. That and that good morphine. <laughs> What's good with uh, James Harden? He, th- he done. You don't think Philly gonna give him that max, boy? Oh, I think he is, but I think he's done. Like, oh, oh, cause as far as like yeah, being what he once was? Yeah, he's yeah. done. Damn. I can respect that. As a score, at least. Yeah, I can respect that. As a score. That. Especially they don't give him that bullshit foul and call no more. Yeah, this he's really no more. he done as a scorer, bro. Yeah. If you ain't getting to the line 15, 20 time, t- times a game, t- you ain't going to be able to do it. His MVP year, I was looking it up because I remember we was talking. Yeah. He was getting to the free throw line. Well, he was shooting about 15 free throws a game. <laughs> so, yeah, he's getting 30, ball, he getting right. 30 yeah. but yeah. he 15 is coming from the free throw line. Then he like shooting seven from thirty two at the field. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. So it's like, he, damn, he killing, but is he really? No. Like, <laughs> and uh, analytics, nah, not at all, man. How yeah. y'all feel about the upcoming football season, bro? I anybody? don't know anybody. College, NFL. I'm heard about the Seahawks, man. Oh, the Seahawks had to be. I'm sorry, oh, oh, man. Yeah, they had to blow that up, man. They had to blow that up, man. It was about that time. Yeah, my soul. Hurt. I just wonder what they're gonna do with Pete Carroll, because I'm sure if you know. Him. That's what I mean. They should have been got rid of him years ago. They love him, though. They love I don't know him. why. I don't know why. All you do is chew that gum hard as hell. <laughs> <laughs> they figure, out, they figure out ways to lose the game on some goofy shit. Still heard about that interception on the one yard. <laughs> if you were a real Seahawks fan, I understand, man, because that was a dumbass call. That shit was dumb as hell. I said, yeah, man, that had to be some Illuminati shit right there. Because why wouldn't you run the ball? Knowing this man, you have Marshawn Lynch. You don't run the ball. Who literally seen all game get a yard and a half, getting hit, all that? Why wouldn't you get this man the ball on a one yard line? He gonna get that. They want him to get MVP. That was re- that was really it, bro. That was really it. I was so hurt. Like you gonna throw that one yard slant? They, 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 yeah, the Bucks still about to. Win, to I mean, excuse Lockett. me. They still about to win this game, bro. <laughs> I still remember who they threw it to. Man, this is man, crazy. They threw it to Ricardo Lockett. This shit is they crazy. Doug Baldwin. I threw a damn wheel right to a real walk, real wheel route to fucking Marshawn Lynch. <laughs> Man, <laughs> something. I it wasn't. It, was, it wasn't a good. Marshall. It wasn't a good play call. It wasn't at all. Man, shout out to the listeners. Man, got to bounce back. How do y'all feel about that number five draft pick for the Pistons? I forgot we was on the oh NBA for a minute. What y'all think about's oh. gonna happen? They need to get my dog from um, Purdue and get rid of uh, Killian Hayes. I'm sorry. Man, Wait, the Pistons got number five draft pick. Yeah. I like Killian Hayes is a big guard, but we, I mean, he from, I know he been hurt, yeah, but from last, like, he is no improvement. Like, even with you being hurt, bro, like, you you can still shoot. You can still, yeah. it's like, bro, like, you, 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 you just five points, three assists a game. Like, I could do that. 
And you getting paid good money. You know what I'm saying? So I mean, I'm not like you six five, you all that, you can defend, but you five points, three assists, bro. Like I'm talking about that dude that's just like John Morant from Purdue. Yeah, yep. That's crazy. Exactly. <laughs> they might as well. Might as well get him or get uh, the big, cause Pistons we got the most six eight centers in the world. Or get the uh, dude from Memphis. Yeah, Jalen Dern. I don't know how that's I pronounce his last name wrong or not. Where y'all think Amani about to go to? He better not, man. He, I hope he don't even do it, bro. He, he just to go. he need to go get. No, him. no, no. He going to he going to school. But he's transferring, so his my bad. Let me put this in context. So he's transferring. All right, I about to say, I know he ain't going his, to his um. Yeah, that's what I was. His 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 school is to transfer to is Seton Hall. Okay. Eastern and Michigan. You better go to Seton Hall. I'm about to say Seton. He's going to Eastern, bro. He's going to Eastern. I bet you he goes to Eastern. Just so he can get the green light. Just he he gonna have the green light, and now and my name never been coached by nobody but his dad in his life, bro. Yeah. So now. He can put his dad on the coaching yeah. staff, and he's better off. He's better off going to Seton Hall. Man. I bet you, I bro. I, I mean, it'll it being a uh, Eastern community. I mean, Ipsy. You know what I'm saying? It because it, it'll it, shine some light to the basketball. Team you know what I'm saying? It. Yeah, and, and it. I don't know. Yeah, but I don't. Yeah, <laughs> Eastern ain't no market team. I can tell you that right I, now. They don't even make it to the damn tournament. Seton Hall. It's it, like it just gonna tournament. sell out. It's just gonna it sell out. It'll put Eastern on TV. Yeah, because Imani. Projected number one, no, so you already know how it's gonna go. That would have been like LeBron going to Akron instead of Ohio State, like yeah. the University of Akron. Like somebody gonna fuck around, hurt him if he go to Eastern. I, I but that's the only thing. Why that's don't. my only thing. Like, bro, you too close to home, it's gonna cause you to get into some bullshit. Mm-hmm. You gonna fuck it up before you even get started for real. Yeah. You close to home like that, bro, is uh, always a good thing. Even with him going to an Auburn Ipsy's, you know what I'm saying? Back doors. Over there fucking with them, over there fucking with them, Washington County, uh, Washington Community College chicks and shit. Because um, the other you know, dude, Dub CC, <laughs> there was another dude that was like one of the top players in the state. Yeah, he went to Providence and he coming back to Eastern. So it's like Eastern low key trying to load up. Mm. That's funny. So yeah, it's we like heroes, huh? we see how they coming though. back. You know what I'm saying? But I'm like y'all, like like I don't know. And y'all know how like people that way play. They like they don't care who you is. They. <laughs> Up that, <laughs> mm-hmm. so I, I ain't wishing that on them. But I already know how like some cats see it. Like Nigga, you know who I am. Like yeah. that, 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 that don't matter when cats is living that way. No, you know what I mean. <laughs> they don't care about none, not none of that. That's very unfortunate. So I just hope you make the right decision. I hope the people around to make the right decision for him. Yeah, and because I can see them trying to push that Eastern, but it's like, you know what I'm saying. I seen a lot of bad comments about that man. I was doing some research on him, see how he was doing, and a lot of people from Michigan talking shit, which is fucked up. Well, you got he got a he went to a great place, bro. Like you went to Memphis, bro, and you were playing for Penny Hardaway. You want to be a guard? Penny is a hundred. Like Penny made an interview. Uh, they he was like, "Money got some developing to do. Like he's not strong enough." Like he basically kept it real. And I was like, it's kind of basically saying like it's kind of hard to play because you're not basically like he a tweener. Like I would have to play him at wing, but he's not strong enough to play wing, but he's not qu- quick enough to play the guard. But you can see that, bro. Like you like you left you left early to go to college, try to get to the league. But like your body not there yet. So it's like your body's not there, bro. Like what do you want? I, <laughs> and like how college is now, like you got cats that's 26, bro, hooping. Yeah. Because of the um that COVID stuff, you yeah. know what I'm saying? They they they, they giving cats the extra years to hoop now because of COVID. Yeah, I don't know, man. I hope it work out for him. I just don't really see it happening, even in that conference. It's hot, bro. Even my like, so if you go to, I don't even what conference is he in? Like, I don't know. I just I, the Mac? I think that's the Mac. Yeah. But that's what's what's he? Uh, yeah, but what's he in hard? Y'all know it's, that's a big East, ain't it? Still, I think so. I think it's, so. He rough, and then I like I'm not trying to be funny. I don't see him lasting in the Big Ten, bro. The Big Ten a whole different monster. No, I was hoping you didn't say he was gonna try to go to Michigan because that'd have been all bad for him. That wouldn't have worked out at all for him. I don't know where you were playing at legitly, cause he's like he got he like he can shoot and score the ball, but on defense, like bro, you were a liability. <laughs> 
Because you you not stronger quick enough, bro. So I don't know. What's the best for him? Yeah, it's definitely it's definitely the Big East. Big yeah, bro. Yeah, I don't even know that'll work out for him either. I don't know. I don't. I don't like. He one of those dudes like you legitly like don't know. Cause even like with Kevin Durant when he was at Texas, yeah, he was big and skinny, but he's still quicker than everybody, faster than everybody getting to a spot. Like when you was watching the money play, like bro, like it's hard if you get to your spot. And then when you get to your shot spot, like you shooting threes off the side of the backboard, b. Like it's like it wasn't, it wasn't looking good. So it, people yeah. pissed that you're not playing, but why I'm gonna put you in the game? You're not there yet. No, period. He look like he ain't gonna. You know what I'm saying? He's not gonna make it to the next level, and if he do, it's. He gonna have to put some weight on, and he really gonna have to work on his game for. He gotta get his IQ up, bro. And he gotta learn how to play without the ball. Out there shooting some bullshit. That's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, when this, it's hard, bro. Too weak to play the three, and then you too slow to play the two, and then you shooting hitting the backboard. You can't. No, that's a fact. That's 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 the that's the real. Right. So, hey, I wish that man little boy. (laughs) Hell yeah, man. Shout out to all the baby mamas with babies, man. Hold your head up, man.